Mount the bracket onto the table and insert the control panel. Connect the cable to the side of the robot and to the control panel. Watch for the LED of the first ball to light up. Now placement, side spin, speed, spin and trajectory can be adjusted. To add another ball, the button for the next ball must be pressed. The next ball will use the settings of the previous ball. All settings can again be adjusted by pressing the corresponding buttons. Using this pattern, up to 7 balls can be programmed. Press and hold the Start-Stop button to play a sample ball using all settings of the currently selected ball highlighted by the flashing LED. To delete a ball, press and hold the specific button until the LED stops flashing. Placement can be changed using the placement buttons. The side spin can also be adjusted accordingly. To lower the ball frequency, press the minus button under Paul per minute. If you hold down the button, the frequency is lowered in faster steps. To speed up the ball frequency, press or hold the plus button accordingly. A maximum of approximately 100 balls per minute can be set. To start interval training, press the cycle button and watch the LED light up. A P is shown on the display. Use the step buttons to enter a playing time in seconds and finish pressing the save button. Now B is shown. Use the same method to enter a break time in seconds. Again, save when finished. The random function plays balls with random settings. Pressing the random button once increases the spread radius from 13 cm to 40 cm. Pressing twice activates random placement. Saved placements will be used in a random order. Pressing three times combines both functions. The spread radius increases and the placement will be selected randomly. The next sequence shows option 2, random placement with normal radius. As a standard, balls are played with a constant frequency. The AFC function allows to adjust the ball frequency automatically to create a more realistic timing between shots. To activate AFC, press and hold both ball per minute buttons for a few seconds. To deactivate AFC, press and hold again. The step buttons allow to navigate between memory positions. To save, press the save button for 2 seconds. Note, only settings for placement and ball type can be saved. To clear a memory position, press and hold the clear button for 2 seconds. The display will flash, showing a free memory position. Select the exercise you wish to change, make or adjust settings as you like and press save to save the exercise. Select the memory position of your exercise and press start to begin playing it.